Hello, welcome to the complete video guide about setting up default apps in Windows 10 Mobile. During the RS2 release, default app settings were expected to arrive to Windows 10 Mobile but it never happened. So literally there was no official way to set default apps in Windows 10 Mobile. But since the registry entries for default apps existed, Interop Tools app has a similar default app settings involving them, which means you can view and change default apps from there. To get to that, open Interop Tools. Then choose this device as the provider. Open the hamburger menu bar and expand the general section. There, click on default apps. Wait for it to load. Through this page, you can change default apps for the listed extensions. All you have to do is find the extension you need to change, change the app and then restart the phone. But if the extension you are searching for is not here, continue to the next part to add it to this page manually. To add new extensions, we need to input them to registry manually. So let's go on about doing that, open Interop tool, and head into the registry browser. Then go to the displayed path in registry. Now as you can see, it's a key full of strings containing extensions and their default apps. Let's say we are going to set Windows Universal Tools app as the default app for XAP extension. Before creating our extension string, we need a special identity name of the target app we need to set as the default app. To get that, we need to go to Packages list in Interop Tools. Find the app and click on any entry of the app. In my case, I need Windows Universal Tool to set as the XAP default app. There, what you need to copy is the family name. To copy it, simply click on the text under the family name. Then it will be copied to clipboard automatically. Now go back to the registry browser. Click on the plus sign in the bottom toolbar. There, in the first input field, type in the extension. In the second field, paste the copied app family name. Then save it, that's it, after rebooting the phone, it will be applied. But, let's try setting another extension for the sake of clear demonstration. Let's set Microsoft App Installer as the default app for APPX and APPX bundle extensions. Do exactly like you did before. After setting the extensions you wanted, reboot the phone for those changes to take effect. After the phone boots back, go open the files of the extensions you set before and they will be opened in their default apps you set earlier. Furthermore, if you go back to the default apps page in Interop Tools, 
you will notice that the extensions you set in registry manually is showing to change at the bottom of the list. That is all to cover about default app setting. Goodbye and have a good day.